पीजीटी फिजिक्स आप डीपीएस पी एस वसुंधरा सेक्टर नाइन फ्रेंड्स आई वुड लाइक टू से समथिंग अबाउट माय स्कूल माय स्कूल इज़ द बेस्ट स्कूल इन द रीजन ऑफ आनंद विहार वसुंधरा वैशाली इंदिरापुरम गाजियाबाद एज वेल एज ऑफ ईस्टर्न डेली My school is celebrating 20th year golden year of its celebration and I feel proud to be associated with this school since last 10 years My dear children it is my it is my second video on YouTube after getting a very good response of my first video 70 out of 70 class 12 physics in which i kept myself thermally insulated wearing cap muffler jacket the reason of above description is essential because there are many videos by this name as i have mentioned in my first video that i will cover one chapter in one video so the first chapter taken here is semiconductor electronics dear friends this video is for above average students working of pn junction diode rectifier zener diode zener diode as constant voltage power regulator etc etc are very common topics and definitely all the students will cover it since my school dps gaziabad vasundhara has its standard so emphasis on such simple question is sheer wastage of time i think but keep on practicing such questions also now it is the time to make a note as well as please like and subscribe my this channel now the series of questions are my first question is why does intrinsic semiconductor behaves as insulator at room temperature i am repeating why does intrinsic semiconductor behaves as insulator at room temperature second question what is the relation between conductivity mobility resistivity of semiconductors in the category of general type of questions energy band gap value of conductor semiconductor and insulator definitely you all will do it the third question is what is the charge on n and p type semiconductor dear children never say it is negative and positive respectively both n and p types are neutral fourth question is with help of formula ne into nh is equal to ni square here ne is number density of free electron nh number density of holes and ni is initial concentration of electron as well as hole it is related with intrinsic ne nh is equal to ni square identification of types of semiconductor that it is p type or n type semiconductor calculation with help of above formula and a good question is in ncert ncert example 14.2 so i hope you all are writing these questions question number 5 ncert exemplar ncert exemplar question number 14.13 14.14 14.15 and 14.16 and 14.30 is also very important question dear children again and again i am saying this list does not contain average question but these are very important after a certain level you all can do and surely you will get a good reward sab koshish karo ho jayega 
हवाओं से लड़ती हवाओं में उड़ती छोटी सी चिड़िया आसमान में कहती है हवाओं से लड़ती हवाओं में उड़ती छोटी सी चिड़िया आसमान में कहती है उड़ने पे आ जाओ तो सारी दुनिया छोटी लगती है उड़ने पे आ जाओ तो सारी दुनिया छोटी लगती है कोशिश करो माई सिक्स क्वेश्चन इज आइडेंटिफिकेशन ऑफ फॉरवर्ड एंड रिवर्स पैस इट इज अ मेजर ड्रॉबैक ऑफ एन सी आर टी नॉट अ सिंगल क्वेश्चन इज देयर इन एग्जाम्पलर क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री अ सिंगल क्वेश्चन यू मे गेट सम आइडिया इन रिफरेंस बुक्स अ लॉट ऑफ क्वेश्चन इन दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन यू हैव टू कीप इन माइंड देन इफ पी इज कनेक्टेड विद हायर पोटेंशियल एंड एन इज कनेक्टेड विद लोअर पोटेंशियल इट विल बी रिवर्स बाय इट विल सॉरी इट विल बी फॉरवर्ड बाय When P is connected with higher potential and N is connected with lower potential, it will be forward bias. And it is given in different ways in reference books, in questions. Like suppose P is connected with five volt and N is connected with ground. Then it is ground means zero voltage, so it is forward bias. Another example: P is connected with minus three. and n is connected with minus 4 <clears throat> so minus 3 volt is greater than minus 4 volt p is connected with minus 3 and n is connected with minus 4 so it is forward bias so by this concept you can identify forward and reverse bias question number 7 what is effect on thickness of barrier potential in forward bias and reverse bias what is effect on thickness of barrier potential in forward bias and reverse bias in another bit can be it we can say what is effect on thickness of depletion region in forward bias and reverse bias sometimes it is asked barrier potential but the exact one is what is effect on thickness of depletion region but you must know both both are the same thing question number 8 example 14.4 of ncert very important question number 9 last paragraph of diode it is not a question last paragraph of diode as rectifier from ncert that is topic number 14.7 it is about the role of capacitor in filter circuit and in diode and full wave rectifier <coughs> question number 10 basic difference in circuit of led and photodiode basic difference in circuit of light emitting diode and photodiode Question number eleven: What is the reason of forward bias connection in light emitting diode? And question number twelve: What is the reason of reverse bias connection of photodiode? About this, I have mentioned, I have explained something, a brief idea in my first video. So keep on watching my videos, and my next chapter will be atom and nuclei. please like it subscribe it all this i am going i am doing for the benefit of my beloved children thank you